Hey, this is Andrew Brown from Exam Pro, and we are taking a look here at dedicated instances. So dedicated instances is designed to help meet regulatory requirements. It also has this concept called dedicated hosts. And this is more for when you have strict server bound licensing that won't support multi-tenancy or cloud deployments. And we'll definitely distinguish that in this course, but just not in this slide in particular. Um, and so to understand uh, dedicated instances or hosts, we need to understand the difference between multi-tenancy and single tenancy. So multi-tenancy, you can think of it like everyone living in the same apartment and single tenancy, you can think of it everyone having their own house. So the idea here is that you have a server. I'm just gonna get my uh, cursor or my pen out here to say server. And you have multiple customers running workloads on the same hardware. And the idea is that they are separated via virtual isolation. So they're using the same server, but it's just software that might be separating them, okay? And then we have the idea of single tenancy. So we have a single customer that has dedicated hardware. So the physical location is what separates customers. Um, and the idea here is that dedicated can be offered via on-demand, reserved, and spots. So that's why we're talking about dedicated here in the pricing model, just so you know that you know even though these are a lot more expensive than on-demand, uh, you can still save by using reserved and also spot, which I was very surprised about. Um, and when you want to choose dedicated, you're just gonna launch your EC2 and you'll have a dropdown where you have that shared. So that's the default, dedicated. So you have dedicated instance and dedicated host. And again, we'll talk about dedicated host uh, later when we need to here. Um, and so again, the reason why um, you know enterprises or large organizations may want to use dedicated instances is because they have a, sec uh, a security concern or obligation about sh uh, against sharing the same hardware with other AWS customers, okay?